you and I make a lot of garbage. Americans throw away enough garbage to fill 65,000 garbage trucks every year. Nope, every day. What? Every day? Did you know that? Americans throw away enough garbage to fill 65,000 garbage trucks every day. That's a lot of garbage. Fact. Americans throw away enough disposable or one-time use cups, spoons, and forks to wrap around the equator 300 times. Have you seen the planet? It's big. It's bigly big. It's huge. Wow, that's a lot of garbage. So you may be saying, garbage, smartage, why should I care? Why should I try to make less garbage? Glad you asked. Number one, fact. The less garbage that you make, the less pollution you make. Oh, thanks. Fact. Number two. Making less garbage conserves the planet's resources. Fact. Number three. Making less garbage saves landfill space. A landfill is the place that we put all of our garbage, and it's a terrible waste of natural resources. Some landfills are as high as mountains. Wouldn't it be great to just make all of that garbage disappear? And we can, using the magic words, reduce, reuse, and recycle. So what does reduce, reuse, and recycle mean? Reduce means to make less waste or a smaller amount of garbage. A good way to make less garbage is to not use single-use or disposable stuff. Instead, try to use reusable stuff when possible. You can drink out of steel or aluminum water bottles just as easily as disposable, but these you can use over and over again, and that reduces garbage. Now you might not believe that this can make a difference, but think of it this way. If you go to the grocery store at least once a week, for a whole year, you're throwing away at least 50 shopping bags. Why not use one of these? It reduces garbage. So, what is the second magic word? That's right, reuse. We already know that we can reuse shopping bags and water bottles, but did you know you can reuse batteries? That's right, rechargeable batteries can be used many, many times over. Use it, recharge it. Use it, recharge it. Use it, recharge it. Disposable battery, you use it one time, you have to throw it away. That is wasteful and pollutes the environment. So, you gotta have batteries to charge your stuff, right? Your computer mouse needs batteries, your remote control car needs batteries. The best reuse choice with batteries is to buy rechargeable batteries. Rechargeable batteries can be used many, many times. There are lots of other ways that you can reuse. In fact, you can upcycle. You can make something, make something out, of out of garbage. Like this, like this awesome, awesome gas, gas can can guitar. Guitar. Oh, oh, yeah! yeah. Bring it home! Bring it home. Bring it home. Bring it home. Bring it home. So here's another really cool example of reuse. This guitar case is actually made of an old briefcase, an old bookshelf, and an old piece of rotted fence. But you know what goes in the guitar case? That's right, a guitar made of a cigar box. Now not only does this cigar box guitar look good, it sounds pretty good too. Give a listen.
Last magic word? That's right, my favorite. Recycle. <laughs> Woo! Thanks. Recycling is amazing. You take old resources and remanufacture them into new resources. Ha <laughs> ha! Lots of things are recyclable. This old piece of paper can be recycled into a new piece of paper. Even this plastic milk jug can be made into something new and original. <laughs> Check it out. This cool recycling truck is made of post-consumer recycled plastic bottles. Post-consumer means somebody already recycled it. 100% post-consumer waste. You and I make a lot of garbage, but making a lot of garbage is not smart because it wastes natural resources, it pollutes the environment, and it wastes valuable landfill space. We don't have to make tons and tons of garbage. We can keep the planet healthy and green forever through the magic of the words reduce, reuse, and recycle. Remember, be good, be amazing, and don't be mean.